Hello, this is Dr. Harika, Epidiatrics from Care Banjara Hills. Today, I'd like to talk about the most frequently asked, is my child at risk for this Omicron variant? Presently, this is very early to talk about the Omicron variant. So, basing on a few studies, they have noted there is sudden increase in pediatric OPD as well as admission cases equating to the highly transmissible Omicron variant. Until now, we have seen there is increased risk of respiratory tract infections, cold, cough, sore throat and mild low-grade fevers. These are complaints similar to that of flu. Considering the pandemic, any uh, patient complaining with these has to be ruled out until proven. Considering the possibility of pandemic, any child presents with these flu complaints has to be taken as a COVID unless proven. Secondly, few studies have shown that less than 5 years of age group are more affected with a condition called as croup. And this is because the airways are usually very narrow, so it takes less inflammation for them to clog them. Though this group is also seen in other viral infections as well, like RSV and para-influenza, where COVID Omicron variant is added to it as well. One thing that has to be remembered is, child are not at risk or the severity is not higher comparatively to that of adults, but they do get sick and might require hospitalizations. So, the precautions that have to be taken are the same old precautionary measures we have been taking since the COVID pandemic has been started. All the people who are around the kids have to be vaccinated because ultimately it comes down the same where unvaccinated are more affected than that of the vaccinated people.